Could America be the next target? That's the specter haunting the homeland following the terror bombing in Kabul. Is there a threat to the United States? 100%. Inside Edition spoke to United CBS News foreign correspondent Charlie Daggett up. Ultimately, ISIS is a suicide death cult. Today, the attacks may be in Afghanistan, but tomorrow, in the weeks ahead, in the months ahead, you can be sure that ISIS will be want, wanting to launch attacks in Europe and in the United States. Next month, the nation will commemorate the 20th anniversary of the 9-11 attacks that triggered the war in Afghanistan. And just two weeks ago, the Department of Homeland Security issued a national terrorism bulletin warning of the risk of targeted violence over the anniversary. It's not a matter of if, it's a matter of when and how and where. Here in Times Square, we've got a police presence behind us here, but we can see that. Yes. What is happening behind the scenes that we can't see? They're trying to figure out specifically who is the next threat. ISIS-K released this photo of the suicide bomber who caused such devastation yesterday. Experts say ISIS-K has 2,000 fighters. They are notorious for their depravity. In 2020, they invaded a maternity ward and killed two babies. In May this year, they targeted an all-girls school in Kabul. Parents have been burying their children, many of them young girls, killed in a bombing attack outside of a school. I'll tell you how evil this is. What happened was just as the school bell rang and the children were running out into the street, as we see in the United States, there was a car bomb that blew up. And that took out a lot of people, a lot of young kids. Then there were two IEDs, so roadside bombs that were already planted there. So when the first responders came in and tried to save lives, those exploded as well. Former Obama Defense Secretary Leon Panetta has an unsettling prediction about the U.S. and Afghanistan. We're going to have to go back in to get ISIS. There's a pretty good chance we can identify who was involved uh, with this attack. Uh, and once we are able to locate them, uh, we have to go after them.